Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. I know you've been waiting for this moment. Amen. Happy Easter. Shalom, shalom, shalom. Hey there. Hallelujah. Go ahead and confess our sin. Go ahead and confess our sin. We are preparing for the morning service. Hallelujah. And hence the delay in coming out. So let us quickly jump on our feet and begin to ask the Father to forgive our numerous sins. Because we are woeful sinners, we've sinned against the heaven and earth, we're not worthy to stand before the Father. But because of his love and mercy, he have mercy upon us in the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead and confess our sin. Go ahead and confess our sin and let us pray this morning. Go ahead and confess our sin. Ask him to forgive whatever sin you have committed, known sins and unknown sins, indeed in thought, in words, and action. Go ahead. Go ahead and ask him to forgive me. Father, I'm a woeful sinner. I've sinned against heaven and earth. I'm not worthy of your presence. I'm not worthy to stand before you this morning. I bow down before the throne of mercy. I bow down at the feet of Christ, of Christ. And I ask, O oh Lord, that my sins be forgiven. Father, may I be forgiven. May you forgive all my numerous sins and numerous sins of everyone under the influence of this telecast. Father, forgive our sins. Cleanse us of every un unrighteousness in the name of Jesus Christ. Purify and sanctify us and make us whole again in the name and blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, everlasting Father, for in Jesus Christ's mighty name we pray. Now go ahead and invite the Holy Spirit. Invite him, ask him to take over, ask him to take over. Ask the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit to take over. Go ahead. Go ahead and ask him to take over. Ask him to take over. Pray, 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 pray. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Pray. Ask the Father to forgive whatever sin you've committed. No sins and no sins indeed in thoughts and ways and action. Ask him to forgive you. Cleanse you of every righteousness. In the name of Jesus Christ and the blood of Jesus Christ. For in Jesus Christ's mighty name we pray. Ask the Holy Spirit once again. Invite him. Ask him to take preeminence, take control. Take dominion. Ask the Holy Spirit of the living God. I am that I am. The immortal redeemer, the alpha and the omega. The omnipotent, omnipresent and omnipresent God. The one that is and now and ever shall be. Ask him to take over. Ask him to take over. Ask him to take over in the name and blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Holy Father, for coming. Come with the fullness of the power. Come with the host of heaven. Thank you, Holy Spirit of the living God, for coming. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We welcome you, welcome you, welcome you, welcome you. In Jesus Christ's mighty name we pray. Hallelujah. Go ahead, take authority in the name of blood of Jesus Christ. I'm buying every power of darkness that is standing against this man. And bind them in the north, south, east, and west. Bind them in the air, land, sea, beneath the sea, wherever they have gathered. The word of God says, surely they shall gather, but not by me. In the book of Isaiah, surely they shall gather, but not by me. Wherever they have gathered against this meeting, for I bind and scatter them. I scatter them in their covers, in their temples, in their altar, in their, in their shrines. Wherever they have gathered in the air, sea, beneath the sea, on the mountain, beneath the sea, wherever they have gathered, for I arise, locate them this morning, and change them the judgment key, never to rise again on the judgment of the Lord in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Father. Thank you, Father, for being our God. Thank you for blessing us spiritually and physically. Thank you for destroying the work of darkness against our life, against our calling. In the name and blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, everlasting Father. For in Jesus Christ, mighty name, we pray. Now, take the key of the kingdom. Begin to open the doors of mercy. Open the doors. Every door the enemy has closed against you. Command them to be open. Command them to be open. Command them to be open. Command the gates of the month of April to be open. You gate of the month of April. Be open right now. Be open unto me. Be open unto my people. I command you gate to be open. You gate be open. Every power mandated at the gate of uh, of April 2018. I command that that get that demon to be destroyed in the name of Jesus. And I command the gate to be open. You gate of April be open unto me. Be open unto my people. Be open unto my ministry. Be open unto my family. Be open unto everyone under the influence of this telecast. You get be open right now. Be open that the King of Glory may come in. In the name of Jesus Christ. Be open right now. Go ahead and command the gate to be open. Command it. Command it. Command it. Command the gate of, uh, of April to be open unto you. The gate of Sunday. The gate of this day. The first day of the month of April 2018. Command the gate to be open. You gate are commanded to be open. Doors are commanded to be open. Doors of favor, doors of breakthrough, doors of success, doors of increase, doors of abundance, doors of enlightenment, doors of favor, doors of future, doors of breakthrough, doors of success, doors of prophetic grace. Be open unto me in the name of Jesus Christ. Be open unto my people. Be open unto everyone under the influence of this telecast. 
Be open right now in the name and blood of Jesus Christ. You get be open. Be open right now. Be open in the north, in the south, in the east, and the west. You get be open in the name of Jesus Christ, in the blood of Jesus Christ. Go ahead, children of God. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. Command the gate to be open. Command the gate to be open. Command the gate to be open. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead and command the gate to be open. Command it. Command in the name of Jesus Christ. Go ahead, children of God. Speak a word right now. You are already in the month of April 2018. Command the gate to be open right now. Command it to be open in the north, south, east, and west. In the LNC, be near the sea. Command the gate to be open. Command the gate of Sunday to be open. In the name of Jesus Christ. The first day of the month of April 2018. Command the gate to be open unto you. We have crossed the bridge and we have taken over. Therefore, every gate be open. Gate of favor. Gate of healing. Gate of success. Gate of prophetic grace. Gate of anointing. Gate of breakthrough. Be open unto my people. Be open unto me. Be open unto my ministry. In the name and blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Father. Thank you, my dear and everlasting Father. We give you praise. We honor. We magnify your holy name. In the name and blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, King of glory. We worship. We glorify you, Father. For in Jesus Christ's mighty name, we pray. I want you to command everything created by God to cooperate with you. Command the sun, the moon, and the star, the earth, and its fullness to cooperate with you. Go ahead and pray that prayer. Say, O Son, I have risen before you. Therefore, I stand on the word in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. I cancel every negative program projected into against me by wicked powers in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Whatever projection, whatever the enemy has projected into, this, into the moon, into the sun, into the stars, into the earth, into the breeze against me, against my ministry, I command them to be rendered powerless in the name of Jesus. I disarm every power of the enemy. Whatever they project into the sun, every affliction, every affliction, every setbacks, they project into the, into, into the air, into the land, to the sea. I disarm and dismantle them in the name of Jesus. I render them powerless in the mighty name of Jesus. I, I render every power at the gate of this month powerless. I disarm them by the authority in the name of of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Holy Spirit of the living God. Father, I give you praise. I give you praise. Everyone that Satan has entered to tempt you this month, I command that person to somersault. I command that demon to somersault and die. And I command that authority of the enemies to be dismantled. I render them powerless. Any one that will come to contend with the power of God before the presence of God this morning, I render them powerless. I disarm them in the name of Jesus Christ, in the blood of Jesus Christ. Thank you, everlasting Father. Thank you, Father. Father, arrest every arrester. Destroy every destroyer. Destroy every power of darkness that, I will, that will come this morning to tempt and try the power of God in Shekinah Grace Ministry, in any living church. Disarm them, disgrace them, wherever they are. By the authority in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Holy Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, King of Kings. Thank you, Lord of Lords. For in Jesus Christ, mighty name we pray. Mighty Father, we give you praise. We honor, we glorify you in the name and blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Mighty Father, I pray for everyone under the influence of this telecast. Father, when we sleep, we sleep like a dead wolf. Don't ever keep our hands our legs. But because of that mercy and love that breathed light into us and made it possible for us to see this day. This is the day, O oh Lord, that you have made or rejoice in me glad in it. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father, I pray for everyone under the influence of this telecast. I bless their body, I bless their soul, I bless their spirit. I bless everything that consigned them. I release favor, peace, joy unto them. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, be free right now from every predicament. Be free from every walk of darkness, wherever they have gathered against you. I set you free. I set your family free. I set your finances free. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Wherever they have gathered against you, against life, I command them to scatter in the name of Jesus Christ. Father, I give you praise. Thank you, Holy Father. Be the glorified, be the exalted, Holy Father, above all things in our life. For in Jesus Christ, mighty name, we pray. The word of God, remember the first day we are reading Psalm 1 and every other Psalm that follow. Until the end of April, hallelujah. Until the end of April, we follow in Psalm 1, Psalm 2, Psalm 3, Psalm 4, Psalm 5, Psalm 6. Until Psalms 38, April is a month that is ending on the 30th. Hallelujah. So until on the 30th of this month, we're going to read Psalm 30. Remember the last month, the month of, April, month of March, we read Psalm 31. So in this case, we read the Psalms according to the number of days. Hallelujah. 
according to number of days. When we began to do this exercise, please let it be inculcated into your mind, into your bones, into your marrow, that you understand the spiritual movement of this world. When you understand the spiritual movement of this world, Satan shall, will have no longer power over you, over your finances, over your health. Any power that takes residence inside of you will be dismantled and rendered powerless because prayer is the key. The more you pray, the more you weaken satanic powers and their enterprise. Enterprise means their business over your, over your life and over your family in the name of Jesus Christ. So go ahead now. Go ahead. Go ahead and pray. Go ahead and pray. You know, go, go ahead and pray. We take someone. We take someone. Are you there, children of God? Hallelujah. Are you there? We're going to go to Psalms chapter number one. Remember, today is the word of God. According to Matthew 28, verse number six, he is risen. He is not here, for he has risen. As he said, come and see place where he was led. Come and see where he was led. He is risen. Hallelujah. He is risen. Amen, amen, amen. The master is risen. Let his resurrection power rest on you. Hallelujah. Let it rest on you in the name of Jesus Christ. As it rests on you, it breaks the power of yoke. It breaks the yoke of darkness, the yoke of sickness, the yoke of failure, the yoke of sin. Therefore, sin power over you is broken forever in the name of Jesus Christ. So quickly go to Psalms number chapter number one. For blessed is the man that walketh in the, not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor standing in the world of sinners, nor standing in the world of sinners, nor standing in the state of the scoffers. But his law, the light is the law of the Lord. On his Lord that he meditated at night, he shall be like a tree planted by the rivers of water that bringeth forth his fruit in his season. And he lives does not wait, and all that does it prosper. The ungodly are not so, they are like, but they are like the which the winds drives away. Therefore, the ungodly shall not stand in judgment, nor sinners in the congregation of righteous. For the Lord knows where righteous and way of ungodly shall perish in the name of Jesus Christ. In the blood of Jesus Christ, I also always advise you to read Psalm 21, Psalm 121. For blessed is the man, men, for I will lift up my eyes unto the hills. From whence come up my hand, my hair come from Lord, whom I add. He not suffer that foot, they will move. He that keep it, they will not slumber. Behold, he that keep it, prophet Isaac. Whenever I slumber, no sleep. The Lord is my keeper, the Lord is my shadow, but my right hand. The sun shall not smile by the day, no more by night. The Lord shall preserve me from all evil, shall preserve my soul. The Lord shall preserve my going and my coming in from this time forth and forevermore. Amen. Let us quickly go to Psalms chapter number two. Why did the heavens rage and the people imagine a thing? The kings of the earth said, the seven ruler really take us together against the Lord and against his anointed said, Let us bread apart the son and cast away from cost from us. Hmm. He that sitteth in heaven shall love the Lord, shall have them in derision. Then shall I speak unto them, Lord, I'm sure this them is so displeasure. Yet, yet have I said, my king, upon my holy hill of Zion, I will declare the word. Up, I will declare the decree the Lord has said unto me, Thou art my son, this day have I begotten thee. Ask of me, and I shall give thee the inheritance for inheritance, and the utmost part of the earth for thy possession. Thou shalt break them with a rod of iron, and thou shalt dust them pieces like a potter's vessel. Be wise now, therefore, O ye kings. Be instructed, angels of the earth. Serve the Lord with, with fear and rejoice with trembling. In case the son lets be angry and ye perish from the way when his right is kindled. When his right is kindled but a little, blessed are all they that put their trust in him. Peace. In the name and blood of Jesus Christ. My Father, my God, thank you for being my God. Thank you for uplifting me spiritually and physically. Thank you for destroying the work of darkness. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, thank you for destroying the work of darkness against your people, against my people, against everyone under the influence of this telecast. Now we are taking the third, the third of Psalm, Psalm chapter number three. Lord, how a day increase that trouble me. Many a day that rise up against me. Many day we wish of my soul. There is no help for him in God's sight. But that, O Lord, act a shed for me. My glory and the lift up of my head. I cry unto the Lord with my voice and heart there of soul in you, Sarah. I lay me down and slept away for the Lord sustains me. I will not be afraid of 10,000 of people that is, that is said to say against me round about. Arise, O Lord, save me, O my God, for thou hast smitten all my enemies upon the cheekbones. Thou hast broken the teeth of ungodly. Salvation belongs to the Lord. The blessings is upon thy people. Peace in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So jump to Psalm chapter number five. Hallelujah. Give ear to my words, O Lord, consider my meditation. How can I do the voice of my cry, my king and my God, for unto thee will I pray. My voice shall end in the morning, in the morning, O Lord, will I direct my prayer unto thee and will look up. For thou art not a God of pleasure and wickedness. Neither shall, neither shall evil dwell with thee. 
The foolish shall not the foolish shall not stand in thy side. Thou hatest all workers of iniquities. Thou shalt destroy them that speak lazy. The Lord will abhor the blood and the sense But as for me, I will come into thy house. In the multitude of thy mates in that fear will I worship towards thy holy temple. Lead me, O Lord, in the righteousness because of my enemies. Make thy way straight for my, straight before my faithful. For there is no faithfulness in their mother. In what part is very wickedness? Their trust are open structure. Destroy thou them, O Lord, let them fall by their own counsel. Destroy thou them, O God, let them fall by their own counsel. Cast them out in the multitude of a transgression for the rebel against thee. But let all those that put their trust in thee rejoice. Let them ever shout for joy, the God that defendeth them. Let them also that love thy name be joyful in thee. For thou, Lord, will bless righteous with favor. Would thou compass my for the seal as with a shield. Peace. In the mighty name of our Lord Jesus Christ, may the Lord compass you with a shield and with a favor. In the name and blood of Jesus Christ.